Hello and welcome to this video. In this video we'll learn how to create a program in Python that will protect your files and folders. This might not be a very effective way or a secure way but it does work. So uh, there's a folder. This is a folder that I will be trying to protect. We have a few data inside. So what I'll do is I'll show you the source code first. I'll show you how the output will be. So this is a code. I'm not going to uh, write from scratch because the duration of the video becomes very long. So first I'll execute and show you how the output will be. So enter the directory of the folder to protect. So this is the folder I'm trying to protect. So I will open this. Uh, I will copy the directory. Copy. And I will paste it here. Now make sure to change the slash to backward slash. And hit enter. Now uh, we'll have to write the name of the folder that we are trying to create. Let's say secret uh, folder. Now this folder will be created in direct. I mean the desktop. So you might you can give any name you want. Then we'll have to give the password. Now make sure the password is a number for this code. So let's say uh, you given uh, the year 2000 or let's say uh, one. Four, five, six. So this is our password, and it can be any any length. It can be of any length, and just give hit enter. So it will give us the output. So this is just a message, not the actual error. So what we'll have to do is, so you can see here, a new folder has been created, secret folder. Now if you open this, uh, we have ten folders. Now inside each folder there will be another folder likewise and you'll have to open this folder now you remember your password that is 1456 so you just have to click 1 4 5 and 6 now in this folder you will see your uh, you will see the folder that you wanted to secure so this is the folder I wanted to secure so it is in this uh, directory so we only know the password and uh, we only can go inside these directories because each folder has subfolders and vice versa. I'm sorry, uh, each folders have subfolders and so on. So that was our output. So I'll just explain you the code. Uh, you can find the code in my GitHub too. So the first thing we'll have to import a module called OS and another module called Shutil. And next I'm trying to get the directory of the folder that I'm trying to secure here. Uh, then I'll create the folder name and the password. And then we'll create a variable to directory that is to dir to dir. And in this we will give the path of and change the slash to backwards. Now next we'll have to uh, use a function of os that is os.part.join. Now we'll pass two parameters that is to dir and hefname. Uh, hefname is the folder name that we try to create. So this will create a new path. Now this do, do to dir will have path. Now next we'll have to write os.mkdir. This will make create a folder in this path. So that's it. The first step was done. A folder of secret folder will be created. Uh, where's that folder? So yeah, so the folder was created and initially it will have nothing. So we'll create a for loop that will run, that will take each and every digit uh, of the password in its uh, every execution, every iteration. Now next we'll create a nested loop that will run 10 times. Now this loop will create this 10 folders, the first 10 folders and we pass try and accept message to in case uh, we creation of folders with the same name so that is why I pass try and accept and that's why it gives me error every time so that doesn't matter actually so first I will use the part dot join and I will convert this uh, uh, j to string and I will uh, create a new path now I will create a folder of this path now using os.mkdir 
Now inside this, let's say first time it will create one first folder and inside this one first folder we have another 10 folders so that is why I use another loop that does the exactly the same thing with just the uh, variable name different now this this is the inner loop so this will create a folder and subfolders and at last I'll create a, a, I'll add a slash to my dir and add, add and add the password that is the first digit of the password or the second digit of the password, current digit of the password to the two DIR. So what it does is let's say my password was uh, one one four five. So initially it will create ten folders and inside first folder it will create another ten folders. So next step when it executes executes this the two DIR uh, path will be uh, this path select folder slash one. So Inside this, it will create another 10 folders and that's how it will work. So at last, when we reach our destination, that is 1, 4, 5, 6. Okay. Oh, we have uh, moved our secret, I mean the dead me folder outside. So the, uh, the folder that we are trying to secure will be stored here. And at last, what we'll have to do is we'll have to use this shootil function. That is we can use dot move and we pass two parameters that is from directory to directory. So it will just move all the files and folders to the current directory that we have created.